Is Century Gothic a conservative or a liberal font? What about Times New Roman? Daniel Tamil and Catherine Henschen, assistant professors of communication from Virginia Tech, conducted a study to find out. They showed a person's name written in several typefaces to participants in an online survey. Then they asked them to rate how liberal or conservative the typeface of the person was. The serif typefaces, those with letters that start and end with small flourishes like Times New Roman and Jubilat, were rated as more conservative than the sans serif typefaces like Gil Sans and Century Gothic. The study also found that people rated the fonts they liked as more aligned with their own political ideology. We don't know if fonts can override what you already think of something or someone, but it does seem that the typefaces graphic designers use can shape how people will perceive a message or a person, and that includes politicians.